Well, hello everyone. This is Kimberly here. Welcome to Diva Designing on a Dime with Kimberly Davis. Today I am coming to you with a home decor haul. I've been shopping at a few of my favorite places and I've been doing a little shopping online. I <laughs> uh, just want to share these items with you. Mainly, uh, I went crazy in Hobby Lobby. That's going to be a large uh, portion of this video and I'm hoping I'm able to put it all in one. If not, there will be a part two. So we're just going to jump right in. I am going to start off with a gift that was sent to me by my girl, my sister, Christy C. Um, she knows uh, since Frankie graduated from the University of Florida. Chump chump go Gators. <laughs> I've been looking for Gator items. I am loving the Gator um, entertainment pieces that I came across last year and I ended up coming across one this year. And she saw something and it's this. Isn't this cute? She picked this up in Home Goods. She ran across it and she shot me a text and said, hey, what do you think of this? And she said, I'm picking it up for you. <laughs> and she sent it out to me right away. Christy, I love him. <laughs> he would go good with that dish that I bought out of Home Goods too. Yes, so I got that from Christy C. Thank you so much, Christy. And speaking of gators, uh, I was shopping online because I couldn't get to Z Gallery. Z Gallery is uh, in Orlando, but I haven't had the opportunity to get over there. I want to get over there in the store and see what they have because they're having a huge sale online. So I'm sure it's on in the stores too. But I saw this a while ago. And let me bend down, excuse me from bending down. Another gator. It's a gator bookend. <laughs> OMG. And this thing is heavy. This is from Z Gallery. This is the only thing I ordered. I was good. But yeah, I can either use it as bookends or place him together. You can barely tell that he is in two pieces. But I love this. Um, I don't know the original price for it. And I paid around $30 the clearance price. Alright. And again, oh, he is heavy. <laughs> now the next item I ordered was online as well. It's actually from Etsy. And it's from the Itsy Bitsy farmhouse can you believe it <laughs> yes I ordered something farmhouse ish and I could have built it myself if I had the time to do it but I didn't I don't have the time to do so and it's this shelf here isn't that pretty now the catch is it's not gonna stay this distressed look all right because I don't like that I'm gonna paint it a solid white or a solid black but yes I ordered that off of the itsy bitsy farmhouse shop on Etsy all right I could have made this myself though um pin my hair up guys because it's bothering me already and we'll jump into the next uh, store, which is Big Lots. All right, guys, Big Lots, and I'm rattling bags. So I apologize for it. Um, went in Big Lots because Big Lots, uh, they have done some changes <laughs> um, in their store um, with their home decor. It's a lot of farmhouse. Um, very few other type of styles and a lot of the stores are going to the farmhouse but I 
I, I wish they would give us a variety of other styles. Um, Cause I'm not really a farmhouse person. But when I saw these few pieces, I had to pick them up and they are not farmhouse. <laughs> and it's this. It's this spoon, pineapple spoon. Um, this was $5 at Big Lots. All right, $5. Love the gold up top. I thought it was beautiful. And <laughs> trying to be careful with this. I have two of these. These canisters, pineapple canisters. This was a splurge because, uh, the spoon rest for, was $5 and the canisters were $14 and I picked up two, all right? Um, but I knew I wanted them. Love the gold up top here again. And I have two of these again, did I say that? <laughs> yes. Now what I was going in there for, because I saw them on IG, on Instagram, they had mugs coffee mugs, pineapple coffee mugs. The mug itself was white with the gold handle. They were sold out. <laughs> they were so I went in Orlando and I checked my nearest one in my area and they were sold out. Went online, guess what? They were sold out. And those mugs are $5, just $5 each. And I wanted to but uh, yeah, I'm hoping they get them back in the stores or get them back online. I keep checking every few days and haven't seen them yet. But yeah, I got two of these pineapples. This, I'm giving you all a heads up. This will be my theme next year. <laughs> Cause I went lemon crazy. So I'm taking them out the bag so you can see I have two. Yeah, I'm shopping for next year. <laughs> so when I saw that, I remembered seeing something in Walmart. All right. And it's this Better Homes and Garden fragrance oil diffuser that plugs in the wall. Pineapple. <laughs> See the theme, guys? So I picked that up. This was, uh, was it five something? Not sure of the price, all right? <laughs> but I picked that up along with the Better Homes and Gardens um, oil here. So yeah, got that to go with the pineapple. I'll probably use this before the end though. <laughs> Next, I'm gonna jump to Dollar Tree. Just have a few things from Dollar Tree because I haven't been picking up uh, or seeing anything major other than the plates. <laughs> the plates, the salad plates. Um, I've had the lemon bowls. I did not pick up the glasses. I just wanted the plates and the salad plates. Last year I picked up the bowls. Now in a previous video guys, I did my breakfast bar. I have it listed up top in the iCards there. And I'm giving away a set of four of these dishes. All right, so if you did not get in or couldn't find them in your store, you might want to try uh, the giveaway. Set of four of the dishes and uh, the dinner plates and the salad plates, all right? Let's see what else I picked up from the Dollar Tree. <laughs> um, I picked up two more 
of the lemon towels. I really don't need any more towels. I have a drawer full of kitchen towels and I'm picking up more. <laughs> but yeah, I picked those up and thought these were cute. You are my sunshine. I love that bike and the fact that it's red and yellow. <laughs> So yeah, I need to go probably pick up two more of those. And this flower sack, because this is considered a flower sack too. Um, we be long together. How cute is that? And you guys saw that I did a welcome to the Beehive uh, kitchen vignette challenge with this and that with Denise Jordan. So, yeah, I'm picking up these stuff too. <laughs> How cute. I picked up a heavy duty storage bag. This is two bags and extra large. Um, I'm using these to store some of my pillows um, that I have uh, on my back patio. I'm going to stick them up under <laughs> my love seat and store them under there, but they will be protected in these bags here. That's just an idea also when you have too many pillows. Then I picked up this waterproof eyeliner pen. And I wish they had these in another color other than Midnight, but this is by e.l.f. So I picked up two. I'm gonna come across good makeup in um, Dollar Tree, I pick it up because I do not like spending an arm and a leg on makeup. <laughs> I'm cheap. <laughs> Picked up a brush, paint brush, because I'm doing a little paint project. And some ibuprofen because I've had a little headache. Don't know what the deal is. But yeah. I picked up two letter boards with 50 letters in it. I thought these were super cute. This is the silver one with the black background. And this is the silver, or is it silver? It's white with the gray. All right. Super cute. I came across a big one in Hobby Lobby after the Christmas sale for $2 and something. <laughs> And I, I love using it, so I said, yeah, I'll pick that up as well. I have a tendency to pick up these glittered uh, frames. I would love for Dollar Tree to get these in silver, because I use silver more than gold, but I've been picking these up anyway, because you never know. Picked up this silver frame also. This is just plain. I love silver. This is something I need to place an order for. Are these mirrors? <laughs> I need some um, square. I don't, I don't think I need any more in the round, but I do need square, so I need to place an order for those. Finally found some more of these, and I know I have some of these in another bag somewhere. My Kiss nails. Because y'all, I need some help. Haven't been wearing them. So yeah, I have those. And I finally came across another one of those bookends that says Inspire. So I'm gonna paint them, I think, silver. Because I don't like this color. It's like a lavender color. And I picked up three bags of sand. I'm planning on doing a project, but I don't know if I'm going to get to it or not. We'll see. <laughs> but yeah, I think that was it from Dollar Tree. Now the next store that I went in, and I only picked up one item, which was shocking, but that day when I went in Ross, it was empty. I was disappointed. <laughs> but anyway, I did stumble across one item that I wanted. And it was this, uh, this jar here. It has a lid, but it's taped down. 
in gold and white. As you know, my eye is going to go in gold and white more. I'm hoping to come across another one of these. But this jar was only $5.99. I couldn't believe it. I said, how pretty is this little jar? And for $5.99, six bucks, yeah, I'm grabbing it. Right now I'm gonna go to some thrifted items. It's just a few pieces. Then I'm gonna jump to Target and then that Hobby Lobby, all right? <laughs> all right guys, I went shopping at my local SPCA thrift as well as our church had a um, yard sale, garage sale indoors because <laughs> it's been too hot to have one outside. Um, this is from my SPCA thrift. I just purchased one because I knew this item here, I just purchased one because I knew I wouldn't be thinking about them during the holidays and uh, came across this one, it was much cheaper. And it's from at home, okay? <laughs> but this gravy boat, trimmed in silver and it's white. So yeah, um, and I use a lot of silver and white during the holidays. I use gold sometimes too. So uh, yeah, I thought this was really nice. Can't wait to clean it up and store it and get ready for the holidays. Yeah, I'm thinking about the holidays already, y'all. All right. And I just did a baby shower for my son and my daughter in love. And in the process, I broke one of my apothecary jars. So note, if you are transporting items, <laughs> Be careful with them. Apothecary jars, I think now I'm gonna go buy a set of the plastic ones because they do make a lot of nice plastic ones in the stores now. But I came across this one and couldn't believe the price. By the way, that gravy boat was $3. Uh, and y'all know I shot my SPCA thrift when they are half off, so I only paid $1.50 for that gravy boat. And I think the regular price of it at home, at, at home is $9.99, all right? But this apothecary jar that I came across, this apothecary jar is a pretty good size. Um, love the fact that it's tall. When I come across these now, especially when they're a good size, I picked them up. And this was marked $5 and I got it for $2.50. <laughs> you can't go anywhere and get an apothecary jar that cheap. You're lucky to go in Ross and in Marshalls and Home Goods and get one for about $14.99. Alright. So I picked that up. Looking for a spot on my table here. Just put that back there. Now this next piece, and I bought some more stuff from my uh, my church yard sale. Uh, I don't know what I did with it. <laughs> anyway, but this piece here, my granddaughter loves. And it is a doll, alright? It's my baby boy. It's by Denise Kunz. K-U-N-Z Pratt, all right? And this is by the Danbury Mint, all right? This is the box. We're gonna take him out. And guys, I did some research on this doll. <laughs> and he is, everybody thinks he's wicked though. The owner of the doll said he looked evil to her. And her mom gave her this doll when she was a little girl but she didn't like the doll. She said she never did like the doll. And I'm like, are you sure you want to sell it? And she says, yes. I said, well, I will love it. And I have a little girl that will love it too. All right. Here's the doll. He's sleep. And I guess that's the thing she didn't like about him. He's sleeping. Let me take him out. He came with some clothes. <laughs> But my granddaughter 
walks around with this doll practicing for her baby brother. Alright? And here he is. His hair is real. The little hair that he has. His outfit is so cute and he feels real, guys. Alright? How precious. <laughs> I'm getting practice in too. But guys, this doll, when I looked it up online, he was $129. All right. The owner at the garage sale sold it to me for $5. Alright, $5. Now what I've been doing with my granddaughter, uh, I box him up. I also let her, you know, just sit there and hold it. And she sits there and watches TV with the doll. <laughs> uh, she don't do much with him. I'm going to see how she takes care of it. She's only four. And uh, yeah, but... She just don't know it yet. I told her this is my doll that I'm letting her hold <laughs> and get practice in for her baby brother. I also used this doll at the baby shower uh, past the baby game, y'all. <laughs> but yeah, I picked him up for five dollars. I couldn't believe it. But uh, she she didn't like like it because he was sleeping. Uh, my boys think it looks evil. They kind of uh, told me, hey, you're bringing something evil in the house like ch uh, child play, Chucky. Uh, we need to get rid of that. And uh, I'm like, there's nothing wrong with this dog. <laughs> nothing wrong with him. But yeah, she loves it. So that's all that matters. Um, I have a large piece over here that I found thrifting. I have no clue where I'm going to put it. Uh, this and that with, with Denise. This was one of those splurge items. Um, have no clue. I'm going to take the camera over there instead of dragging it over here and letting you see it. So stay tuned here. All right, guys. And this is what I picked up is this floor lamp from my SPCA Thrift. Um, I thought it was nice. If I don't have a place for it, which I'm thinking of a spot, I have to see if it'll work in there. Um, it does need a new lampshade, which I have to go shopping for lampshades anyway. But yeah, um, I picked this up. They had uh, $25 on this floor lamp, and I got it for $12.50 at my local SPCA thrift store. I'm thinking about painting it off-white to match my fireplace and putting it or placing it in my family room. So we'll see. But for $12.50, I couldn't leave it there. Um, if I don't use it, I'm sure I will find a home for it uh, with one of my family members. All right. A very nice piece. The next item is from Target. Um, what I'm going to do, I'm going to lean it up against the wall because it's a fairly large piece. I knew I had to <laughs> run and get this too because it was something I knew I wanted um, because I'm bringing a lot of golds in with my silver. So let me show you what I picked up. I picked up this beautiful artwork. It was on sale this week. I think the regular price of it was $59.99 and I got it for $51.99. But I knew I wanted it. I knew I had to have it. And yeah, uh, can't wait to use this in my home. 
Look at that pattern in that artwork. Very, very pretty. It has the gold. It has the silver. has the off-white. I'm loving it. Love that marble effect. And the frame is gold. Love it, love it, love it. Now, let's dig into all of this Hobby Lobby stuff that I picked up. And there's a few more pieces that I want to run and go get. <laughs> but I'm waiting for the sale to drop to 75 because the pieces that I want, they are, they are a little pricey. This I just caught on sale. And I've had it for a while and did not show it. But thinking of the holidays, when guests come over and they ask, what's the Wi-Fi password? <laughs> so I picked up Welcome to Our Home. The Wi-Fi password is, all right, this little sign. It's regular price, $8.99, and I got it, I think, for like half off. Or tabletop, I think. Yeah. So just thinking of the holidays and Everybody asked that question. <laughs> What's the Wi-Fi passcode? I don't even know my Wi-Fi passcode. I have to ask my boys every time. Okay, I think everything else is on the Spring Shop 66% off, all right? I think. <laughs> okay, so. I picked this up. This was actually, I think, 75% off. I'm not sure. I don't have my glasses on to see. I see the clearance price, but anyway. I picked up this uh, throw. I actually saw this throw in red last week. <laughs> saw two of them in red and went back in there to get it after thinking about it. Don't think about it when it's, you know, really nipping at you to pick it up pick it up when you see it anything but um they the red one was gone the two red ones were gone and i saw this one and an off-white one and i could have sworn i picked up an off-white one last year um but i picked this one up because this matches my sofa perfectly my new sofas in my family room and Regular price, this was $59.99, and I got it for $14.99, so I got $40 off, all right? According to home, Hobby Lobby, excuse me. But it's very soft. I can put this out now because it's thin to snuggle on the couch with, all right? So I got that. I picked up this bottle stopper. I wanted the stirs, the pink stirs. I wanted two sets of the pink stirs, but they were gone just like that. But the bottle stopper is pink. It's pretty. It's blingy. Guys, you know I love pink too now. Just Not just as much as my red, but it's up there. Um, yeah, so this was $9.99 with 66% off. All right. So I stick this stuff back in the bag. I'm going to have fun putting this stuff away. But I did come across these spoons. They have the coastal theme to it. Uh, have shells, crabs, fish, and a turtle. I have two boxes of them. I'm going to enjoy eating some ice cream <laughs> with these. Or, uh, what is it, the shave ice? That's something I want to. I want an ice cream maker. But I want the one that we used to crank. <laughs> I don't even think they make that anymore. Um, getting off topic, right? Uh, this is part of the set that I think I want. And I'm waiting on to drop down some more. It's a server set of two. This, this bad boy is heavy. This was regular price, $19.99. Alright. So I picked that up. 
because I'm always serving salads or something, some type of salad. So that was that in that bag. Okay, like I needed any more of these, but I picked them up. Um, some kitchen towels and mittens and oven mitt <laughs> in the black and white. Thought these were pretty. These were 99 cents each. Oven mitt here, 99 cents. And then this one was a dollar and 24 cents. So I have a set of those, black and white, or black and off white, not black and white. Ooh boy, I'm gonna have some fun putting this stuff away. Then I saw this because I have a baby one. And when I saw it, I was like, oh yes. <laughs> this large picture stripe picture. Very pretty. I can put my uh, kitchen utensils in here. I can do so many things with this. Put some flowers in here. Um, yeah. Uh, this was regular price $29.99 and I got it for $7.49. Love this. And I'm seeing a fiend here <laughs> and didn't realize it. Then I picked up this pedestal. Now this kind of matches that uh, two-tiered stand that my hubby had me pick up for two dollars and some change, y'all, two ninety-nine. That I had to glue together. This kind of matches that. And uh, this pedestal was regular price twenty-nine ninety-nine, and I got it for seven forty-nine. This thing is big. I love the size of it. All right, very nice. Now, when I saw this sign here, I had to have it. Uh, I don't know what it is about Hobby Lobby signs, but I, I love walking Hobby Lobby. I can go in Hobby Lobby and not pick up a thing, y'all. But I love to go in Hobby Lobby and read the signs that they have in it because they're so inspirational, um, have a lot of meaning to them. If I had a huge house, those signs would be all over my house, all right? But this one is going in my kitchen, and it says, Say Grace, all right? I'm hoping, because the space above my cabinets, uh, uh, I hope it fits up there. So I want to redecorate up top. So I have that. Okay, moving along, moving along. I told y'all I was on that black and white kick. <laughs> Sorry for the ruffling of the bags. I picked up this soap dispenser and the polka dot. So not only stripes, I picked up polka dots. Because when I use this, I'm gonna mix the polka dots with the stripes. The patterns do not scare me at all, all right? <laughs> Patterns and colors. I'll mix it in a minute. This, by the way, was $9.99 regular price, $2.49 clearance. Then I picked up the spoon rest. This spoon rest is super cute, has a little bow up here. Not that it's gonna stay because this is with hot glue and you have to wash it. But um, yeah, this was. $9.99 regular price, $2.49. How cute. Um, they did have a smaller picture to match the bigger picture. I passed on it because I have one that I picked up from Target a couple of years ago. So yeah, I'll be pairing all of that together. Then, Christy C picked up some of these for me and I'm actually looking at them because I have them in my china cabinet, Christy. 
<laughs> on a pedestal. Uh, she picked up four of these for me. And I like to do things instead of, since I have a large family, I like to do them instead of six, eight, or even ten. All right. Anything that I pick up now for my uh, entertainment needs, I'm picking them, picking them up in the quantity of six, eight, and ten. Christy picked me up four, and I picked up another four. I cleaned them out. This is all that they had. Um, and if I go on another Hobby Lobby, which is another Hobby Lobby, I do want to go in. I went in there one day and forgot in Orlando that they closed at eight o'clock. Um, I'm gonna pick them up. I'm gonna pick two more up. But yeah, these beautiful napkin rings, floral napkin rings. How cute is that? Um, yeah, $2.99 with 66% off. You can't beat it, right? So these, after I finish taping, <laughs> we'll most likely go in there with the other ones. So those napkin rings will most likely go in there with the other one so I can have them together. Um, yeah, got a piece of hair here. All right, moving along. Cause I know this video is gonna be so, 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 so long. Um, something else I picked up because I couldn't remember. I knew I picked up some last year and I knew I needed some more. Anyway, let me see how many I picked up. One, two, three, four, five, six. Um, picked up six of these. And it's the, and again, I picked these up last year. The placemats, the lemon placemats. Now, Christy C. did pick me up some of the ones from Dollar Tree last year. But to kind of uh, change it up a little bit, when I came across these last year, I knew I wanted them, but they didn't have the amount in that I wanted. So now I have them. These were $3.99 regular price, 66% off, y'all. All right. I also picked up this beaded decor with the letter D and y'all might say Kim that looks a little farmhouse to me yeah it may look a little farmhouse but it also can look coastal <laughs> um, when I pick up stuff like this I think along the lines of coastal not farmhouse yeah it can go both ways uh, this little beaded item was $7.99 regular price Paid a dollar ninety-nine for it. Now I picked up two. Get the lid on it, right? I picked up two of these out of the spring shop, um, and they were seven ninety-nine each. These little containers, white containers here. I plan on putting salt, I have two again, plan on putting salt on one, pepper on the other. All right, so I have that. I went back in there to take a look at those white canisters that I want because I really don't need them. They will be sitting out on my uh, countertop mainly for decorations or I could have pulled something out the pantry and put something else in the spot. I didn't get them, I missed out on them. I didn't need them, right? So that was that bag. This was uh, the 4th of July items. This is 30% off now. Um, and it's yard cutting day, so once they are finished, I'm going to stick this out. It's a garden flag, America, home of the parade.
I haven't done anything on my front stoop <laughs> pertaining to uh, the 4th of July. At this point, I don't even know if it's gonna get done or not because uh, it's supposed to be raining for the next few days. Um, and I wanted to do my red, white, and boom blue tablescape outside. It may get done inside <laughs> because of the rain, guys. We'll see. All right, I have two of these. Oh, we're almost done. We're almost done. I have two of these. Sorry for the ruffling. Um, and it's two pedestals. It's a small size. Square. Thought that was different to have a square one. And I'm wondering, did I miss out? Because I could have sworn I saw a large one. I'm going to have to go back in. Because I would love to have a square large one. And uh, yeah. So I picked two of these up. Um, regular price $19.99. Screenshot. So two. And these can be used year round, y'all. Okay. Again, I have two. Going back to those pineapples. <laughs> now, I was looking for this one and didn't see it when I ran in there for my uh, Men in Your Life tablescape. I didn't see it. And then I go in there the other day and guess what I come stumble across? This runner. <laughs> striped runner. You guys, I have napkins to match this. I have pillows to match this. Alright. Yeah, this was $19.99 with 66% off. Alright. And finally, lastly. Lastly, lastly, lastly. Oh. I picked up some baskets. I actually saw these baskets, similar baskets in Target. Yeah, Target. And Hobby Lobby has these in black. I even saw them in teal. But I picked them up in white because my kitchen, a lot of my kitchen, well, my cabinets are white. I'm going to have to fight to pull these apart. I picked up four of these. Picked up four. I started to pick them up in black, but I was like, uh, where would I use them? I know I would use the white. But where would I put the black ones? And I couldn't think of an area, so I left it there. These were $19.99. I think I paid them $6 and some change for each of these. And... I have four. So guys, I have cleaned up in Hobby Lobby. I cleaned up everywhere, but mainly Hobby Lobby. Those people know me now in that Hobby Lobby. So that's ridiculous, right? <laughs> oh boy. Actually, two of my uh, church members, they work in there. Um, but yeah, and I got my eye on it. Just a couple more pieces. Waiting for that price to hit 75 and then I'll think about it. I'll go in there and put them in my shopping cart and walk around and really think, do I really want them? By the way, we have hit 18 plus subscribers. Thank you so much to all the faithful subscribers that return time and time and time again to support the channel. Some of you have been there with me from the beginning. And I thank the, the new ones as well. My newbies, I thank you so much for stopping by the channel and watching the videos. Um, you just don't know how much that means to me. Um, a lot of you say that you are inspired and that's why I'm here to inspire you in some way to do 
or to love your home. Love on your home. So here's to 18 plus. We're pushing for more. But guys, that is it for this shopping haul. Now the fun part is I get to put all of this stuff away and start again next month or the month after that. I think I'm going to give myself a break in July. Don't fool me to it. <laughs> oh boy. Thank you so much for watching. You take care. You be blessed. And I will see you on the next video. Love you guys. Have a blessed day.